In other news tonight, drill, baby drill. Our region relies on that, but drilling within city limits near neighborhoods, that gives people pause. There is a lot of heavy traffic and noise 24 hours a day on a drilling site. It could soon be a reality, though, for people living and working near the Midland Air Park. Permian Deep Rock is about to secure a lease with the city to drill for oil within city limits. The company made a promise tonight that their operations would have little impact to people that live and work in that area. Jonathan Palasek, he joins us now live with more. Hi, Jonathan. Good evening, Tatum. The company says that two things are at play here. First, that the city would stand to make a whole lot of money off of this site, try $180 million plus over the next 20 years. Second, new technology means for a quieter work site for this area's new neighbor. Permian Deep Rock has done this before, that is, drill wells in the city. We have uh, about 25 wells now that we operate in the city of so we're very well versed with all the requirements of the city drilling code, and we, uh, we've done a good job. But as the drilling occurs near businesses and residential areas, the question becomes, how will the drilling impact them? Most people in Midland know what drilling rigs look like and, and pumping units, and we're gonna keep all that to a minimum, and the sound will be uh, as technically, it, our operations will be as technically quiet as humanly possible. But how does Permian Deep Rock plan to not disturb those living and working near the air park? Also, uh, in the area of noise abatement, the vast majority of our operations will use electric motors that will that are very, very quiet. This was something that Permian Deep Rock had in mind as they were getting started with the plans for drilling, thanks to new technology. And fortunately, uh, that technology has developed uh, more recently than other oil field technology, which is old. The electrical technology is fairly new, and we knew that we could utilize that. Once Permian Deep Rock gets final approval from the city council, they hope that they can start drilling a little bit later this year. Reporting live in Midland, Jonathan Palasik, News West 9.